Okay, there are a few things you can do in Windows 10 to get a much better frame rate in your gaming. Um, some things you can do. Uh, first thing you need to do, right down in the start menu here, type maintenance. Or just maintenance will get you there. And what you're going to want to do before you game is start maintenance and let it finish. Otherwise it could interrupt you if it thinks the computer's idle. Uh, sometimes it'll start doing this in the background and that will harm your frame rate, especially if you're doing a recording or anything along with your gaming. Uh, so start the maintenance and let that finish. And you can also type in virus down here. Virus and threat protection will pop up. You're going to want to go to virus and threat protection settings, manage settings, and turn this off. And then, yes. And that'll turn itself back on after a while. Um, usually after you do a restart, that'll turn itself back on. So if you're surfing the web, you can turn that back on from there as well. Um, also, before you start your game, you're going to want to turn these things off. Like I have OBS Studio running right now, so I'm not going to turn that off in my microphone. But NVIDIA settings, I can exit that. Um, I usually have an IQ uh, program running down here for my mouse. Turn that off. So those are the things you're going to want to do each time before you start your game. Uh, run your maintenance, turn off your antivirus, and turn off any other running programs. Uh, now what's going to make a huge difference is disabling some services that Windows 10 comes with. Uh, Windows 10 comes with a lot of uh, different features that you don't necessarily need running uh, if you're running a game. And so to turn some of those off, you're going to go down here to the start, search thing and type config or MS config if you're old like me uh, and you're gonna want to go to services you can see I already have a bunch of stuff turned off in here you can safely turn off um, a bunch of stuff in here without aff affecting your gaming performance um, a lot of stuff I'm not gonna pretend like I know everything what all these programs do but I did some research and uh, and we can safely turn off these programs uh, like I'll join router service application layer gateway service can go off um, armory crate and these ASUS programs came with my my computer and none of them need to be running right now uh, battle eye service uh, like the manufacturer is unknown I don't know what it does either I could look it up but uh, you know if it says unknown I probably don't need it running uh, Bluetooth, I'm not using any Bluetooth devices, so I'm turning those off. Bluetooth support, Bluetooth audio gateway, etc. Uh, connected user experiences, yeah, you can turn that off. Uh, fax, I'm not doing any faxing. Google update, uh, yeah, just anything Google, you can turn that off. Um, Intel Bluetooth service, again, I'm not using any Bluetooth. Uh, geolocation service, I don't think uh, anybody needs to know exactly where I'm at while I'm playing a game. Uh, lang language experience service, nope. Download maps manager, nope. Turn that off. Nahimic service, you can turn that off. Look that up, uh, I don't think even they know what it does. Uh, let's see, uh, origin web, uh, origin client service and origin web helper service can both go off. Uh, phone service for panel overdrive retail demo service rog live support those can go off secondary logon that can go off remote desktop configuration get rid of that print spooler we're not printing steam client service we don't need steam running in the background for most of our games Tele telephony remote desktop services nope we don't need those running I'm sure there's some other stuff in here we can turn off as well, but um, these are the major things. Hyper-V data, uh, all this stuff, we, we don't need that running. I don't anyway. Uh, Windows Biometric Service, nope, not logging in using any biometric data to play a game. Windows Connect Now, nope, we don't need it. Windows Insider Service, don't need it. Parental Controls, Windows Media Player and Network, nope don't need them to run a game Windows Update yeah uh, Xbox Live you know sometimes you can uh, record um, your game using the Xbox stuff I'm using a different software so I have all the Xbox stuff turned off 
Uh, and that's it so far. I'm sure there are many more things in here that don't need to be running, but those helped a lot. Just turning those off, I got a huge difference in my frame rate. And so once you're done uh, checking those off, just hit OK or Apply, and it's going to want you to restart your computer for those to take effect. And once it's done, you only have to do that once. But these are the things like uh, running maintenance, killing your virus program, uh, and turn off uh, running programs. That will help a lot. So I hope this gets somebody uh, some help. Men a better frame rate. Thanks for watching.